Hello my family, welcome back again to our channel. Today we are going to prepare. I'm going to show you how to prepare silver fish with Irish fosho. This is a maize flour that we are going to use with our Irish. And these are the veggies we are going to use. Uh, this is our silver fish. We call this omena in our language. You can just comment on how you call it in your language. So I've already finished the sorted. I picked out all the unnecessary stuff that was in. Now I'm going to just fry it slightly without cooking oil, just frying it to remove some small stones that could be there and make it more nice. So after five minutes, unlock it. I'm now going to remove it all from the stove. So this is our boiled water, I'm adding it to the silver fish. This is to enable the small bones in the silver fish to be soaked and remove any unnecessary dirt in the silver fish. Some people just don't like silver fish because they don't know how to prepare it. Just adding the onions. Give it a mix until they turn to golden brown. Add the green pepper. Add the silver fish. Keep on stirring for like three minutes. After three minutes, add the eggplants. Give it a mix for two minutes. After two minutes, add the carrots and the tomatoes. some spices that I'm going to put. We have reiko, salt, tamarind, cumin and beef masala. Just going to add some water. I'm going to let it to cook on low heat for five minutes then it will be ready. So I'm going to add the posho flour into the Irish. Then I mingle like the way I do the posho. In case you see the water is not enough, you add some. You just continue mingling. Now you can see our Irish posho is ready. If you have been following me up to now, that means you've liked the video. Just like, share and subscribe. You can comment in your language how you call it. I'll be so grateful. And uh, for the new subscribers, thank you very much. And uh, for those who have not yet subscribed, you're also most welcome. Just before you finish to watch, drop a comment and subscribe. Thank you. See you next time.